Welcome to your daily devotional, My Life Today, December, and Eternal Life. December 16th, a beautiful country. And truly, if they had been mindful of that country from whence they came out, they might have had opportunity to have returned. But now they desire a better country that is an heavenly, wherefore God is not ashamed to be called their God, for he hath prepared for them a city. Hebrews 11 verses 15 and 16 A fear of making the future inheritance seem to material has led many to spiritualize away the very truth which lead us to look upon it as our home. Christ assured his disciples that he went to prepare mansions for them in the Father's house. Those who accept the teachings of God's word will not be wholly ignorant concerning the heavenly abode. And yet, I hath not seen, nor ill heard, neither have entered into the heart of men the things which God hath prepared for them that love him. Human language is inadequate to describe the reward of the righteous. It will be known only to those who behold it. No finite mind can comprehend the glory of the paradise of God. In the Bible, the inheritance of the saved is called a country. There, the heavenly shepherd leads his flock to fountains of living waters. The tree of life yields its fruit every month, and the leaves of the tree offer the service of the nations. There are ever-flowing streams, clear as crystal, and beside them, waving trees cast their shadows upon the path prepared for the ransom of the Lord. The grass will be a living green and will never wither. There will be roses and lilies and all kinds of flowers there. They will never blight or fade or lose their beauty and fragrance. The lion, we should much dread and fear here, will then lie down with the lamb, and everything in the new earth will be peace and harmony. The trees of the new earth will be straight and lofty, without deformity. In the new earth, there are no chilling winds, no disagreeable changes. The atmosphere is ever right and healthy, an eternal life, December 16th.